What's going on everybody? Cool to under here back with another NASCAR diecast review video. Today we're going to be looking at Juan Pablo Montoya's 2007 uh, Texaco Haviland car um, for Winter Circle. Um, comes in a crazy packaging, very tall for such a diecast review, I guess. There's the car, the little accessory it comes with, hood magnet. And of course, you got know, Juan Montoya and uh, the 42 back here. You got just some uh, stuff about Juan Montoya and his team. Uh, you got Juan Pablo Montoya there. You got Texaco, Havoline, uh, Chip Ganassi Racing. So, yeah, there's all your copyright. And uh, so let's just go ahead and pop this out of the box here. Um, this is definitely a rare one. There is the trinket it comes with. And. Your car is over there. So we'll go ahead and take a look at the little accessory first. It is just the 2007 Nextel Cup Series schedule. Um, so if you want to read all that, go ahead and pause. It is just your uh, hood magnet, which I like. It's a plastic hood with a magnet. Lionel should make these. Um, they just make them flat when they're a magnet. Um, I actually like the 3D's a little bit better. They're easier to take off the fridge as well without ruining them. But, yeah, I've got a few of these uh, 2007's now. So, yeah, there's that. And now we can get on to the die cast here. There it is. Beautiful. Very, very hard to find. I actually saw this in two versions. Uh, this version which I was even debating on getting first. And I saw it in its hood opening rubber tire version, which I call the Elites. It's actually the Platinum Series. Uh, I thought about getting it, but I didn't have enough money. And I just, I wanted the die cast. So I picked up this version instead. So yeah, whoever's lucky you probably got the Platinum Series already because I'm sure that flew right off. Anyways, here it is. You've got Texaco and Haveline there on the uh, charger nose. you got these red lines coming from both ways. Um, I'm not sure. Don't help. It's still black. Okay. Um, here you can see the 42 with more of that red uh, lining going right across the car here. you got Haveline. you got, what is that? I don't know what that is, but yeah, with Tech Techron, I think, maybe, I don't know. Got number 42 there, red 42, of course. Um, it is weird that they put that little bit of gray right there on the corner. You got Trust Your Car. Uh, yeah, Trust Your Car to the Texaco. Um, you got the rookie stripes there, because he was, was a, excuse me, a rookie there. And this series, or in this season, I can't speak. Um, Express uh, lube right there on the deck lid. And of course, your other side. Uh huh. There is, this was there when I got it. Uh, not used at all. So, uh, yeah, little mark there. I know you can barely see it. Let me see if I can focus it there. A little bit of a paint. Wow, really? Really? They, they messed up the whole logo there. We thought Lionel was bad. Wow, we. Huh. That's interesting. Anyways, a very, very nice car to add to the collection for sure. Um, I definitely like this car a lot. Um, Juan Montoya, not the greatest driver in NASCAR ever, actually, one of the best in NASCAR. But nonetheless, it is a very nice car. So, with that being said, guys, that's the end of the video. I'm actually going to put Danica back here. For the thumbnail because I need his plastic hood involved. I actually wish you couldn't see her car. Uh-huh. Make sure this review comes out after the Danic Patrick review now. <laughs> Anyways guys, please like this video once again. 
uh, leave a comment, subscribe for more. I read all the comments and everything, so I truly appreciate it. I truly appreciate you guys watching and enjoying the videos. And, uh, yeah, if I get the hood this day, uh, I will see you guys in the next Diecast review video. Which, uh, should be good. That should be another Stuart Haas car, so there's a hint for you. Anyways, I said too much. Peace.